Hey, what's up? How you guys doing? This lesson is going to be about economic structure. You need to know this as an economic student. This lesson is not going to take very long. So just take a few minutes to watch the video and then you'll be all right. An economy structure tells us what the composition and pattern of trade is in that country. If we examine economic structure, we are looking at what industries are popular in that country and where their output is coming from. When examining economic structure, we divide the economy up into different sectors. The first sector is called the primary sector. It's the sector that is responsible for extracting the Earth's natural resources. So for example, things like oil, coal, you know, wood from trees, etc. An example of a country that relies very much on its primary sector is Ghana in Africa. Most of the cocoa beans that go into your chocolate bars come from there. Next up we have the secondary sector. The secondary sector is all about taking those extractive resources and manufacturing them and turning them into goods. A country with a huge secondary sector is China. About 25% of the world's exports come from there. They've got tons of machinery, tons of factories there. It's crazy. Finally, we have the tertiary and quaternary sectors. Now these are both service-based sectors. It's all about the services industries. And that's why I'm talking about these two sectors together. Things like public transport, accommodation services, finance services, they're all service-based. Now the difference between tertiary and quaternary is that the quaternary based sector is more a knowledge based services sector. So things like information technology, IT, uh, research and development, consultancy, those things are more in the quaternary sector. So what type of economy does the UK have then? The UK is more of a service based economy. We produce services more than we produce goods. So this means that our economy is geared more towards tertiary and quaternary sectors than the primary and secondary. We don't really do much in the primary sector. We don't really extract many resources. We don't really manufacture that many goods. That's why our secondary sector is not very big anymore. So today services are more the UK's thing. Yeah, so that's the end of the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please hit that like button down below and please hit subscribe as well. You can also go on my website if you want to have a look at some revision pages or some extra exercises to complete. And you can always email me at any time. But if you don't want to do any of those things, jog on, mate. I'm not going to beg you. Anyways, guys, I'll see you in the next video.